Karen, another Karen, white woman having an issue. She doesn't think she can get through this, and it's a hundred cars behind her because she doesn't think she can get through without scratching up her car. So she's holding everybody up. Philadelphia. All right. Well, the point. In this calling the police thing, black people think that white people only call the police on them. Think, look at how disgustingly arrogant and infinitesimally minded sun words are. They think white people only call the police on them. Press one. I live in a white town, man. White people call the police on each other over putting your trash out on the wrong day. If you put your trash out on the wrong day, they call the police on, the, on your ass if you white. You park in their parking space, they'll call you the fucking police on you. White people call the police on each other. 90 going north. But sun words are so fucking um arrogant. This this country's made us so arrogant and in, in, in social media and BLM and shit has made us so um I can't even think of the word. Um, it's right on narcissistic. We're such narcissists. And we only can see through the prism of our, we can't see anything else. We still think that it's black and white world. We still think that the dynamic in the world is black and white. We don't give a damn about no Indians, no Britos. No Bengalis, no tigers. We don't care about none of it. We just think it's black and white. That's the whole dynamic across the whole globe. We're morons, man. These white people call the police on each other all the time. Salute to um, abolish the Nineteenth Amendment. <laughs> Been listening for a while now. Never contributed, just to say thanks for calling out my idiot glider people. Seems like they're trying to replace the gliders with Andersons. Hope we can somehow get along, but doubtful. Y'all gonna have to take the lead, man. Y'all gonna have to take the lead, man. We don't, we just can't do it, man. Um, and this video is a prime example of that. Watch, watch how even though these gliders have this tense interaction, and it's a lot of different gliders. There's gliders at the moving with the moving company. There's a hundred cars behind her. There's this glider woman in the in the um, car, and just watch how they're able to all walk away unscathed. If this was sons. Somebody would have gotten beaten to a pulp or killed. Someone would have gotten beaten to a pulp or killed. Get him! Get him! I'm in the cup! I'll get your license plate! I'll get you arrested! Move your fucking car! Damn! No, it's not alright! You're holding up the world! You get up! She knows! See, if they were sisters, that sister would have got out that car and started swinging. 
crust one. There's no way no system unless somebody come up to their car and scream on them like that. No way in hell, man. No way in hell, my G. Salute to Mark I, man, from Jersey. Salute to Charles S. Charles Sandusky, man. I got for another night, man. I got to chop up that interview, man. I got to chop that shit up, man. Shout out to Charles S., man. See, even when Gladys act like assholes and ridiculous and goddamn out of line, nobody gets fucking hurt. 